Hello everyone, it's me Nancy. Welcome back to our live tutorials. Happy Tuesday. It is a single de Mayo today, I believe, and nobody will like pay attention on it too. It was so busy. Hi Live Ras, how are you? Happy Tuesday. Thanks so much for tuning in. Um, You know, seeing that we're getting a lot of fun things so cool and play around with this. Hi, Sean, by Strauss. Hello, how are you? If you missed my live video yesterday, we had a really cool stunning um, different nails that we did. Let me get some of them out here. Oh, actually, is that I have it in. Um, the other spot I don't have it's right here with me but it's really fun yesterday we did all diamond pixies and some stickers if you miss it uh, feel free to go over to Facebook to watch all of that really quick short live tutorials also on video IGTV you want to find some video as well Hi, Unika. How are you? Thanks so much for tuning in. Hey, who did you set? Welcome to our live tutorial. Let me show you really quick. Hey, I see. How are you? Hi, Debbie. Let me show you. It's really cool. If you want to see some of the Diamond Dust Pixie today, it's going to be fun as well. Hi Tammy, how are you? Thanks so much for tuning in. Great. This is the uh, nails that we did it last night. Hey Janae. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, let's get some fun nails today and uh, I'm excited to share with you a different cool techniques. I'm gonna quit sharing it and if you are on Facebook you can do me a favor you can share it to your bestie or for your friends because sometimes I'm busy over here and I couldn't say it, sharing it to anyone so just for someone who would like to learn some cool different techniques just really basics easy simple so then you can enjoying it and this is a great it's gonna be for uh, Either you're gonna learn some techniques for when you get back to salon or it's something that you can do it with the press on now so it's gonna be really much fun I'm messing around with like really cool um, right here in my hands right here it's really cute and easy to do which is the gel painting precision brush and white and black at the moment you will see more colors coming in the future really soon I'm excited because it's so easy to use and which is I'm using this for this like really simple um, roses and then cute butterflies the background is darker so I'm just kind of messing around but imagine it is going in with the white color like a black and white so today our theme is gonna be black and white color so let's do some black and white um, designs first it's really simple easy with Chan Fafoy and crystal placements and hi Brad, how are you? Hi Chantella, thanks so much for tuning in. Sorry, I get all the stuff in here. Hopefully, it was getting distracted on your way. Okay, so I have the nails that the white nails right here. If you want to do like completely a themes of black and white, simple, easy, I am going to using um, Chan Fu Foy premium Chan Foy in the black bottles so if you get the white bottle make sure you are keying it for 60 seconds and I'm gonna do it right half of the nails and you can do the other way you can do however diagnose however you would like it okay great so 30 seconds for this um, premium eye hold chan for foy 
And I am going to using, he has a lot of different boys, so cute and stunning. This one is a uh, set that I got it out from Collections Channel 4, number 25. I got a few of them. I got like, it's really cool. It's half five of them are the black and white Channel 4 lace. And um, the other five of them is um, white. So the 25. Just for your for your information hello Instagram thanks so much for tuning in if you are first time welcome to our um, live tutorial and I have another right here so I picked this one looks super cute though Scissors right there. Just cut maybe part of it. And then you can do lace under half. Is that if I don't get in here, it means that I didn't, I forgot to have the chanfu foils on it. Look good. Not bad at all. If you want to, you can always like lay it back up, apply the gels on it, lay it back up, and then you can lay them on. It's just completely chanfu. So I am going to put some cute crystals on it. I'm gonna using a start with the condensed glue gels. I hold condensed glue gel. It's just a really good news. If you're on uh, Amazon and you're fans of Amazon's Prime, the condensed glue gels is um, is on Amazon markets for your convenience too. If you are shopping some things with you know households and stuff, you can pick it up from Amazon. And if you have Prime's uh, member, you're probably gonna. I think it's free shipping for two day shipping. For the Prime's member and uh, you can pick it up and also along with precision glue for your convenience great it's so thick density which is awesome because it's gonna really keep flat back 3d char charms chains and all accessory and even encapsulating all glitters and encapsulating all stickers, trendy stickers, it stay really flat and nice. Like, as a lot of videos that I got to share with you. So if you miss it, you can always watch it on our IGTV. So I'm gonna go ahead and using a no white top coat. This no white top coat and uh, unkia condensed glue gel, which is I have unkia the condensed glue gel, will help grab all the crystals base, and it will adhere nicely after you clear it under LED light. Really easy, simple, and everybody can do like from beginners, especially there's a lot of beginners asking oh, what is the best way to using for adhered crystals to be nice and without feeling um, frustrated and it's gonna be like they are coming off or how you can able to place them nicely without looks cluttery so I'm using this is the onyx um, metallics metal and it's one of my favorites I think I have some first in there can you get it off mm -hmm. hi Lily how are you Yeah, he's right here and helping us. Bye, Vaz. Yes. Did you lady have a good day? So, 
with this I'm probably gonna using either is obsidians you can do like blinked out completely on the other side either you can do it as um, AB or you can use this as uh, obsidian crystal however you would like to or you can leave it alone like this and it looks really cute though so I'm gonna put some obsidian beads in here I'm looking for some obsidian beads right there and still a lot of questions how we can able to um, place the crystals on nicely the closer the tighter the crystal is the better it's gonna last and you can go from there and create so many different cute way hi ladies on instagram everybody i just want to say hi to everyone i will able to look up on my screen in a little bit hope everyone have a great day today i always keep myself really busy just stay going really fast You can continue doing it all and tie like along with the nails if you would like to. I really like this. It's simple and it's really um, easy to do. And then if the clients like the theme of pink and black, you can use something similar like this. But using um, the pink background, it's depending they can do it like I think it's hot pink. It looks really good with black as well. It just depends on the, if the clients like it, you can do that for them. A lot of you will probably offer to trying like obsidian beads, but this is really attractive. I just want to put three beads in there but if you want to do one beat or not even any beats on it it looks cute as well I'm really obsessed with this centerpiece this is one of my favorites and it's one of our really uh, best-selling centerpiece as well you know what we never suggest you reusing it but then when you come back you see this one or like concrete lasts so long when you're removing it of course it's not gonna be like shining like this but you can see this still come and hold peace when you remove them beautiful you can give it to your clients if they want to keep it but you don't have to be using them i'm so excited because you know what we have so many different content every single day we'll feel like we don't have enough time to show you every single detail and every single techniques well i mean the design because if you are watching us doing some of the press on glue on for your clients nails we would love to share some of the techniques if you feel like it's really cool and helpful feel free to pick it up this is all for use from us and brought to you free of charge from us so we are so excited all right, so this one it looks good, but I might, I might continue to lean. But if you don't want it, you don't have to. Let me see, because you still have some space here. I think it's good. You can continue; it doesn't matter. Looks so cute. And now you happy with this? We're gonna cure this for a sixty second. Thank you so much, True Beauty Queens. And make sure if you need to adjust anything, you adjust it before you uh, tear under LED light. So then that way you can't, your design is going to come out exactly what you're expecting. It's so simple and it's super easy, simple, quick. If you're doing for the clients or if you are doing a press on, glue on nails for your clients right now, 
such a great an idea for you to do like for instance if your client is asking for a uh, black and white theme nails which is we are going to work on the black and white theme today's for you yes and tell us if you have a really good proper lamb any other lamb if you have a rechargeable lamb make sure they are really good chalks um foon chalks and work properly and this chan for boy you will never go wrong with this doesn't matter what four chan for four gels you're using the other ones is 30 seconds and this one is uh this one is 30 seconds the other ones is 60 seconds so hi iris love brazil thank you so much for tuning in Thank you, Debbie. I am glad you like it. Just want to say hello to everyone. All right, so that looks so fabulous. And I am going to use it one of um, Crystal Bestie, which is precision glue. And on the other end, I'm going to open it. It was. It is the brush, so it's like dual in. Just unscrew the cap, and if in case you need to fill in with some smaller part or smaller beads, you can use that end. And then this end is for you to using it to fill in all the caps, like gaps, cracks, edges of the crystals and the beads, so you can fill it right here, right? It's scratchy right here, so you're gonna feel it first. Each time you squeeze out, it's just that much. Little bottles go a long way. Also, these guys are also available on Amazon Prime as well. If you are shopping for your convenience, doing stuff that you need to do, your um, uh, products or whatever that how house you're using and you're buying it and then you can pick it up from Amazon as well for your convenience and you will get it from Amazon Primes and is shipped to you by Amazon also if you like to get all different cool techniques and ideas you can also get it from our official website at glitzaccessoryandsuch.com or if you are local in Pensacola, Florida you can get it from one of our distributors amazing distributor is Nails Company in Pensacola so I'm feeling this. They also have this as well. I feel scratchy, so I'm gonna feel it in. And so now it looks really perfect, it's great, no issue at all. But I am always going back with my twin tip brush. And I like the twin tip brush on the other end that I you see me using a lot with different art and stuff. And I just give it a little quick swipe. So then that way it doesn't have leaving all that extras like precision glue. Lumpy, lumpy, bumpy. Lumpy, bumpy, so you don't feel it. Okay, here for 60 seconds. I'm really obsessed with this nail. So cute. question can you use dip powder to mix with hot gel that's a good question but I'm not sure Debbie that's a good question though quick question using dipping powder to mix with the hot gel that's a quick that's a good question I'm not sure you can able to mix it though uh, Chantella I will find down more information for you Debbie please stay tuned so then I can give you um, uh, maybe is accurate answer you know it could be yes and could be no because you know what hot gels and dipping powders they both is polymer you know so i will find out more information for you i have a question when i apply here's a question from chantella when i i have a question when i apply stickers using a gel then no wipe top coat and then apply the sticker then cure it right uh chantella when you do, no, when you, 
when you apply sticker, you using the gel. No, um, Chantella, when you apply the sticker, you're gonna use sticker first. You lay on the two coat of the gel polish. If you have a tacky of gel polish, like you, some of gel polish that has really, uh, really slick, like tacky layer, then you might might want to make sure you remove that with alcohol. So then it's remove all the tacky layer. So then your pre adhesive um, stickers were able to stay on because, like say this one, the back of um, I need a tweezer. So when is the back of the um, sticker right here that have really good pre-adhesive? So then sometimes it will be slippery with your um, tacky layer. So you want to remove it first. And then when you remove, you're going to lay your stickers on the nail first. Like for instance, like this, you're going to lay all the sticker on your nail first the way you want it. Or if after you're done with your fusioning design, and then you lay your um, sticker first, and then after that you're gonna using condensed gel and no white top coat. And if you don't want any crystal, that's how you're gonna cure. But if you want crystals placements on it, so then you're gonna that's just one the time you're using a crystal placement, then you cure it. So hope I um, answer your questions. So this is a final look for this beautiful nails. Hope you like this easy, simple, quick right here for all beginners even your expert which is you know i always love to learn something new everything you offer me new to learn i'm i am on it so all right so if you want you can do whole nails or on the other end you can do whole entire crystal placement so either way it's gonna be great all right so let's move on to the cute next ones right here and don't forget to close this red cap when you get this one on it do do not get too excited and then oh okay i got it and i'm so excited and threw this cap away this will help close completely save your bottles of your precision glue stay a long long time which is of course you store it in a not in right in direct to the sun because it's a gel so it's gonna cure and um and it prevents from spillings and clocking on the needles because you want to this needle to be really sharp and clean so then you can feel all different between cracks of crystals uh, and beads so I will put the red cap in just for you just in case you're in here so this is two bestie right now is available on our website also is if you are in the Prime member on Amazon, you can get this two besties on and feel really sit back and ensure this is gonna hold your crystal is really a good time. And make sure your lamb you're using is being a good food charts if you have rechargeable lamb and then cure it properly. So that is a two. I don't know, it's like I think I'll get it somehow it's separate from Instagram. I'm sorry, Instagram right here just in case your shoppings for you know everything else on Amazon you can get it and you can get it from our distributor or our website all right so if you want to learn something fun so we can do some um, sugaring we can do some oh we can do some sugar rings with butterfly sugar ring, but I did it as a black on really dark background. You want to see that. Hey, Dana, thanks so much for tuning in, sweetie. All right, so, or if you want, we can do it some uh, really super cute uh, rose on this background. And then I also have really cute ones here. We're doing the black and white theme today. Hi, Light Bars. Hi, Money Back. Hi, Vanessa. Hi, Janae. Just want to make sure. Uh, who is the nail tech here? We'll work with um, Sarah. Sarah will give you her answer. 
Hi, Sarisa. Hi, Sonia. Just want to say hello to everyone. Um, Shades on nails. Hello, how are you? Hi, Zoe. Great, so awesome. So let's move on. Do you want to see butterflies or you want to see both? I can do both. I can do is um, uh, beautiful roses, crystal placement, and then butterflies. So cute butterflies. I like the butterflies as well. Is it something for someone who are not like sure about painting and then you just want black and white butterflies? Healthy brownies, live brass is good. So we can do, maybe it's just plain cute uh, butterflies. And I have is my uh, black bottle right here. And it's really simple, easy for a lot of beginner, okay? So if you are not crazy or good at uh, painting, you are totally fine because the same with me. So, but I'm not afraid of to try it. So we gotta give it a try, right? So if you want, you can always like separate the whole and tie the nails with um, like half right here because we wanna do that um, the wings for the butterflies. And I like this precision's uh, brush. Super easy and you can like really go over it again. There's so many different ways to do butterflies, everyone, I think. And then um, there's nothing is wrong or right. All right. So I'm just like outline at first. This is something for is really simple, easy for beginners. And then you're gonna draw her wing. You can do it like super simple. You know, be honest, drawing a butterflies will be a lot of my challenge. I'm not gonna lie to you, but I'm not afraid of it and I'm gonna try to practice it and And it's really cool things about this big butterflies because you can outline it so it doesn't matter. You don't have to be like completely perfect at first. It's kind of fun to do it right on. I didn't have anything back on back. You can do chrome, you can do fusioning. you would like it and I did this nails I did one coat of a really matte top coat is really sway matte so it stay really nice and it doesn't have like um, don't leave any like a residue strokes looks at all I keep repeating it and give it a nice outline. And it's really cool because this precision brush is really do a work for me. Um, I used to using with some um, tin tip brush. Tin tip brush is good, but tin tip brush is doesn't get a long stroke like um, the stripe like this.
you can continue doing it and do another line. Make this one a little bit softer look. And continue with this one. And just give it a little bit like if you want your strokes to be really thin just really gentle don't do it too heavy-handed and then this is really a great ratio that this precision brush bring it to you it's really hard to explain it how it is works uh, I just leave it my hand is really I'm a really heavy-handed person though so I just you know really like really feather touch it and it really worked out you gotta explain it yourself because it's hard for me to explain it to you how easy it is and it's how precise this one does it is um, really cool though and I'm not good at painting at all so if you all like seeing is really awesome like nail professional artist right here and like but hey at least I will able to do it in like a basic down so I'm gonna show you that it's gonna be able to do it and this one if you don't do any sugaring you can flash key this and then you can start outline your butterflies more and get more dot and like address your butterflies but then I'm gonna do some sugaring that's why I make sure that my strokes gonna be a little bit load up with the gel so then it can pick up my sugaring Explain it yourself because there's this freaking brush is amazing especially for beginners so you're gonna do it right on his I don't know maybe her I guess I don't know the butterflies And Instagram to see so I'm gonna load it just a little bit more this is super simple basics for a lot of uh, beginners this I'm having so much fun with this brush and this the consistency of the gel painting is not smear it's not runny but it's not too thick like a pot that we usually do with thick and so concentrate. This one is giving me a flexibility for me to draw with confidence. Like I say confident, like I'm in front of you and I'm gonna fit up like I messed up with this, but it didn't, it's been really good to me. All right. You can dress up your more if you want to. There you go. You think it's good? If you're happy with this, we're gonna sprinkle the. I'm gonna soften 
her details on her wings right now so then we can sprinkle some uh, shoe ring on it and we here and this now is gonna be uh, completely done great we will take a little bit right there oh this one looks super cute so if you don't want like for instance if you don't want sugar rings on it you can start doing a little bit more details and then you can using more detail and using a puck and like the uh, dot two right here and you can dot the white color so it make a contrast like uh, black and white I think it looks beautiful so I am going to uh, no it's not flash gear we are going to um, getting sugar ring on this she's really pretty it's one of the jars I took it out from the tray though I think you think I'm gonna thinking like in the tray will help me less messy but look at me it would be in the worst but it's okay well, if the clients, if we usually with the clients, I'm holding the tray and I can just sprinkle it. Make sure you sprinkle it like good at least two or three times until it's absorbing it to your gels. I can't wait to do more fun stuff with this precision brush. That's the most uh, fundamental colors, which is black and white. You will never go wrong with this too. So a little bit messy while we'll clean it up look at that and now we're gonna cure it for 60 seconds and we can just dust off all the excess um, sugar rings and you're gonna get the effects of beautiful butterflies so let me cure it for 60 seconds and I'm gonna remove this because it's a little bit messy right now Hi Diva, how are you? Money back. Hey Money back, how are you? Any question, please feel free to ask. Sometime if you send us the DM or uh, email, we're trying to get back to you like as soon as possible, like within 24 hours. But it's sometimes was like really uh, responded back really fast, but sometimes it's over. Um, uh, I think it was swimming with a lot of uh, DMs or email is always the best. Alright, so I'm going to dust this off because it's a little bit messy and I don't want the ladies to see it all messy stuff. Yeah. Alright. Great. What is the next nails we're going to do after this beautiful... Oh, and we are going to do some cute... Um... Alright. Oh, this is probably stick on my gel stuff. It's okay, I'm gonna remove it. Not a big deal. There you go, ladies. Really easy, simple butterflies and sugar ring. If any of you are doing just this one, just from the gel residues and the stick on sugar ring. Just remove that. On the edges sorry because the black and white is really picky we don't want any of the great yeah okay she's so cute it's like really simple easy right here so cute and you can do in any background like you can do even in the chrome colors Foil, like we having that one the other ones we did it in a foil like um dark colors but you can do it in like a black and white doesn't matter whatever you like you will never go wrong with this so let's see I really want that one here 
is hold on I think do I have another white um what else would you like me to share with you doing a roses with the um pre-season brush let me see if your request yes good question all right oh money back I want to know about here's a question from money back I want to know about the shears how the shear gel how many drop of the colors do you use base or top great questions um it really depends you can mix it with gels on the base gels or top gels um, but if you want I would do it with the either with the base because just in case you need a little bit tacky layer like say last time we did we did with the sheer gel uh, we mix it with the base gels and um, and uh, I think we did the base because I did on the top of this I did uh, um, I think I did the 40 gels so a good question we got Polly can do that once let me see what we're getting here we have two black okay I can do that once we can do that once for the sheer top coat for us today if any of you will miss that live video I also I'll do a video today and then I also can tag you with the video that we did it before it's really um, cute money back so oh thank you cake and sweet I'm glad that you ladies like that cute butterflies. It's really cute symbols. I just want to always sometimes, you know, is basic is you know fundamentals that we can always you can never go wrong with this. Um, all right, so let's do some of this fun money back. Are you ready for that? All right, so beige gels. You need the beige gels, and I'm using this one. Doesn't matter base coat you have. This one I'm using it from uh, CND. Okay, so and just uh, like a gel polish. Thank you, Kathy. Uh, Chantella, any gel polish? We we are using a variety of different gel polish for so CND. We have we have Kira Sky. We have. Um, D&D gel polish I mean the gel polish or regular nails polish so here is a black gel polish I'm gonna do just one drop so here if you want to make your sheer like jelly look like if you want really transparent then you are gonna drop six drop like a ratio of one and six drop so it make it like a really sheer black top coat uh, or like a black colors of jelly but if you want to doing it like a little bit more coverage so you're gonna drop three drop of uh, base gels so what we're gonna do is drop one two three Show Chantella this. It's not polished wise. Oh. She thought it was polished. Chantella, we using this the gel painting pre season brush. It's not gel polish because gel polish is the uh, uh it's not thick, you know, viscosity enough like a gel painting. So then, if you're using a gel painting, it's just really loose and really um, runny. But this one is. A gel painting but in the bottles with the pre-season brush so it's make it all of like a nail professional like us so much better and it's already have super cute and precise brush there for you right there you will never like you don't need to even trim it you don't even need to mess around with any brushes so I'm excited because that's gonna be like 
total tall different colors come in so I'm a freaking excited so now I would using a dot two to mix it because I'm not gonna using a brush because the brush is not gonna mix it like evenly and it's my you know getting um, not even and it's kind of hard for my brush so I'm gonna using a dot two so I have three drop of the no uh, of base coat bay gels okay it's bay gel it's not the bay nail polish it's bay gel polish so I'm gonna mix it up right and now I'm ready to polish this on it. Sorry, it's a little bit shiny on that. Um, we tried to get, I don't know, the Facebook and Instagram can see. Oh, you are very welcome, Chantel. I'm so glad you asked. Money back. Money back. Are you here? You're welcome. Okay, you're ready. Great, so I have a um, tinted brush with me right now. So I am gonna pick it up. Saturate my brush really well. And I'm gonna polish it. So if you want to be sheer look, for instance, if the clients that come in and want like a glass nails with sheer look and like jelly look in the black, right? You can using a clear tip for clients, but the clients are doing this, then you can using on the natural tip. So it depends on however your clients prefer. Uh, but this one I dropped three drops, so it's make it really nice. We can do six drops. Six drops make it really sheer. Like basically you can really see it in like lace sheer look. All right, so I'm gonna key this. Quick for 60 second. If you, can, you can always go back to second coat and make it like even more. All right. Looks cute though. So I'm going to saturate my brush again. And if you want to be like a more transparent uh, money back and for all you ladies who are curious about this one, you can drop two more or three more. But if you do that, you make sure you get it enough for all 10 nails so your ratio is look exactly the same. You don't want to do two nails and run out of the colors and then you have to mix it again. So you want to make sure if the clients don't want to do all 10 nails, you want to make sure you make it enough for all 10 nails. Um, or if the client's just doing two rings fingers, then you, that's, that's enough for two rings fingers, you know? Because they don't want to do whole set for the clients. So... My order is flying. That's awesome. Kick and sweet. Hola. Christ, the Marine. How are you? All right. So if you want to do another coat, I don't know if I want to do another coat, you can. It looks really nice. And it looks like um, kind of a sheer look. I get this design for you since we changed to this. So we're going to change in a little bit. Great. Here's again for um, 60 seconds. Here you go. And then you can still have this one to do another nail. So I think it's like a one drop of the black gel polish and then three drop of the um, bay gels will give you two nails. So if you need more than that for, oh, here, let me, can I um, show you too, see now I am here with everyone. So I am going to wipe my brush off, okay? It's, I'm not dipping in alcohol or acetone at all and you can still see the black residues of pigments right there. So I am going to do, either you're gonna using uh, bay gels, all you can do is uh, no wet top coat, either way. So I'm gonna drop one drop of the base or the top, either ones. Drop it right there, right? So then you're gonna just soar the brush. This is keep your brush, it will last forever with you. I mean, well, I say it unless you like, don't cap it on. I'm really pleased with this and um, then I start releasing a lot of black pigments here you see that the brush is release it off and I see like all the bubble and stuff so then I'm gonna wipe it off and 
nicely keep it nice shape and I'm gonna cap put the caps on so then this brush will be always being protected and it's never gonna um, be sad at all so really good so then you can do uh, let me see if I can do something with this maybe we can use this one let me do this one how about that uh, black precision brush since we are in a black and white here and should we do black on black and black on black it looks good and I put some AB crystals on it so it's gonna be so stunning so I am gonna be using this this is I'm so pleased with this especially for me not really like so good with painting I have to admit it I'm not gonna lie to you so using this and your strokes just have a stationary on the board of your fingers so whatever fingers you feel comfortable with you're gonna hold it give it a light touch and move the brush and turn the client's nails right so the lighter you touch the thinner your strokes gonna be and you can always repeating it if you want to darker your uh, strokes um, I have a hard time to doing it like a stroke like that too so you are not only one and you're not alone I am gonna really like I can't wait to say you to share with you doing a lot of cool different vibes and stuff too. Look at that! You can do it like a lace in like no time. This, uh, this brush it does everything for me already so if you want to like to be another then it's like you can go in a between I think it looks great great I'm gonna flash key it for like maybe 10 seconds and I'll move on to the other just to be make sure that and you can go with another um, like even thinner just 10 seconds Uh, live rust, you, your question is what's a basin top? I mean the for the cleansing, I'm sorry, I'm mean. Alright, so uh, notice I have it right here. I just want to show you this Just wipe off the excess you don't basically you don't have much in there And then I can go on the other side The reason I just flash key it so then that way um, it's easy so you don't have to worry about the stroke you did it before. back if you need to and then move your fingers and your nails at the same time because it's the, the um, consistency of the gel painting is so I'm so pleased with this because it's not runny or it's not like a thick density like a pot the pot sometimes if you want to do really like a thin look like this I dilute it a little bit with the uh, bay gels which is I shared with a lot of different video before 
but this one you don't need to dilute to nothing and you can draw it really cute easy with the French look as well so now I'm gonna flash key it quick for um, 10 seconds So now you get like the laser like that. If you want, you can just put your crystals um, along with the crux, uh, the crux line. The polish you for the butterfly. Chantella, I this butterfly you mean? Uh, I mean, you mean Chantella? I'm sorry. The question for this butterfly it is a gel painting. Yeah, you answer that. Okay, I just want to make sure I answer it. So now you can finish with this by putting um, condensed glue gels, no white top coat, and you can put your crystal right on each um, section right there. It's gonna look so freaking stunning. Either way, however you would like it. So if you want to do is some roses, like a black roses, we can having some fun with that as well if you want to. You want to see that? Hi, April. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and do it, okay? And this is gonna be for, it's just to make it look so cute and complete. So I'm gonna do the rose right in the middle. You can do it on the side, you can do it on the edges, however you would like. And just make a little letter C, like first. It look like Chan for four, but it's gel painting. Chan for four is cute already, but this one is like more fun look for the drawing. Just this, just in case that you have a client's request for a painting, the gel, like the nails. I usually give it like in the center like a big part of the petals a little bit bigger so it's make it look more beautiful and natural look you can always go over with this because this pre-season brush the tips really easy to work with I need to see it really closer detail because it's um I think I got a little bit of reflections of the lighting I can't see it because it was so bright I okay, will move that one can't see it because yeah. can you see it now Instagram no man will see it it's hard to see that okay let me bring it up and see how it's we can see it well because you have my thumb blast it's a lot dark no, it looks beautiful. It is, but it's hard to see. Wait to see until we are uh, finished. This one is beautiful. So you're watching the time is gonna be end in just seconds i'm gonna be right back okay everyone on instagram
my Instagram. Sorry to get a cut off because it's like 60 minutes from Instagram. So then Instagram will cut it off. Then we have to end and come back. Hello Instagram, thanks so much for coming back in. This is, I'm really pleased with this because the brush, it will do everything for me. Like I basically don't have to do much. Can you see it? sticking on the details on this it's so fun to do this one and just basically you just touch and put the tip of your petals and just leave it up that's all you need to do and I'm not gonna lie to you you gotta experience your sound to, to see that how easy it is Tell if you want to. Doesn't take much time, but it's getting really cute. But if you're happy with this, we're gonna cure it fast cure for 30 seconds. Janice, hello, BK, hi Sulisa. Thanks so much for tuning back in. We're just using that brush to do the uh, rose, and we did the cute butterflies earlier with sugar ring. Just using this really super easy, simple precision brush gel painting. So it's a little bit well. The colors are the same. Is uh, black, jet black, but it's just the the um consistency a little bit thinner so easy for you to do some really easy um, painting this one you can also like dilute a little bit with the base and you know gels but with this one you don't have to and it's not like a runny at all really pigmented hi Mary hi Rhonda hi Sonia It's sure it blank okay so now I want to put the condensed glue gels hello mom all right so I'm gonna using condensed glue gels and put some uh, cute crystals on it you can completely leave it like this and top coat it looks so beautiful and stunning but I'm gonna put some crystals on just make a little bit bling. Huh, what didn't even I think? I can put um I can even put like a butterfly on it. Like look at that so you can do this cute butterfly on. Super cute if you want to. Just for your information or your preference. And I am going to using a no white top coat and this no white top coat and Ankiya condensed glue gel will help 
grab the base of the crystal, stay in nice place. It's not going to come off for a good at least three weeks. You and your clients can be in sure seat back and relax. You don't have to worry about it's coming off. I think can you close this one, please? Floating the top coat on the top of Ankea condensed glue gels. And so we are going to put some cute crystal AB. Oh, this one is super cute. You can do AB or you can do I know this one it's gonna be good too. I'm gonna to put some super C on it. Super cute. I'm using size, probably size SS5. Four. The smaller is, you can put the bigger ones on it. Looks cute. It's so tiny on the tray. And they're just um, I need a smaller one. Can you thank you? Can you get some smaller one, please? Maybe. Yeah. I think I just need maybe one or two more. Sorry, I have a thousand tray around me, and then the words not on my reach at that moment. There you go. You can put the bigger one or you can put right in the middles. It totally it doesn't matter. Um, however you like it and your clients like it. I think it's going to be stunning if any of you are doing... Um, Press on a glue on set of nails. It's going to be really gorgeous. For this, like you're doing all set and then you have lace only and then this two rings finger will be rose. So if you're happy with this, what we're going to cure that for is um, 60 seconds. And we're going to go back and check to see if we have any cracks like a gap between the crystals. Usually when I place that and I was doing it really um, little gently pressed down so make sure that the crystal will stay on. Great so my gear for 60 seconds. You can do it like that. Um, I don't know how it's like the stripe like that and then you can put your uh, stickers cute stickers on it and you, or you can put the gold beads on it gold bead between that uh, the stripe I think it's gonna look really cool hello thanks so much lady for tuning in thank you Janae thank you everyone thanks Amanda Keja April Live Rass Money back. Sarisa. Shanisa's here. Thanks so much, Oli. Yanni. So many of you. Thanks so much for tuning in. 
I love the gel glue techniques and so my clients so thanks so much pro lovers I appreciate it so much I'm so glad you like it let's see it's premiering on YouTube right now the unicorn nails oh thank you so much Sarisa hope you like that unicorn nails all right so this is great and because it's all done with the top coat it's like all done so you don't have to messing around with this only you need to do is just to double secure by using um, precision glue so just quick and tip and trick if you are shopping online on Amazon Prime you can find this um, precision glue from a glitz is highest quality of the glue gels and you can find it on our Amazon Primes it's your convenience and also you can find that premiums of is um, condensed glue gel as well at your convenience if you just need to grab like your uh, precision glue and condensed glue gels you can get that from Amazon as well at your convenience also if you get other things that you want to pick it up you can always find all the products that we're using to share tutorials from our official website glitzaccessoryandsuch.com and you can also get it from our distributors in Florida it's nail company so I think it looks good I feel in the gap I feel like it get a little bit of like scratchy I can feel that so I squeeze just a little bit so each time you're using just squeeze that much little bit of glue gels go a long way so then you can cure under LED light and then we also have still have a lot of questions that emails and DM were asking about so what is um, the proper way and then the best way to place the crystal without worry about um, it's coming off I'm gonna share with you the car the true factor if you have to add one's items from uh, the websites and with your product you don't forget to check this one out to just you know take a look and see what you get your condensed blue gels in full size the big size right now and then a no wipe top coat and your precision glue and along with your beautiful uh, mega mix crystals which is mixed in the sizes and the color so you have a variety of colors for you I think I have one of the tray right here with my mixed um, colors and that is for beginners if you don't want to be a good um, crystal placement this isn't one of them that I have some some of them in here but it's have a lot more in the jar so just I pour some in the uh, tray so you have all variety of colors to play with and let me wipe this one quick off so this is for money bags who are asking about the what do you call this jelly or sheer nails sheer nails right here just the uh, alcohol I'm gonna wipe it off right so we did like three nails so far this one the third nail we did and we did this super cute ones at first and with our second butterflies with sugar rings I'm really obsessed with this I don't know the so black and white always get me and um, questions for the like, fusionings and all that foil a really cute beautiful we're gonna do it continue with the tutorial sometime well this week and then next week is all like some of stuff the favorite stuff that you're asking for it's gonna restock it sometimes this week uh, or beginning of next week but keep checking but there's a lot of so many hundreds of products that are available some of like the favorite one um, but I love this so much you can do another ones like that for the butterflies you put them together it's gonna be so cute Oh. great so let me go into the last one oh this is super cute this one really cute one and the white ones you can do the black ones with the um, white flowers This is, I have to say, I'm not gonna lie, it's really my favorite flowers. I don't know why. We did it yesterday. You wanna see it again? Mm -hmm. You can 
do a different one. We'll do some fusion ink tomorrow because today is it outer. Black and white theme. This is special for any of you or should we do this one? This is a white rose. I can draw the white rose on that. Maybe we should do a white rose. I can do a white rose if you want to see that. Anyone interested in to see the white rose with shoe rings in the white so I really like that as well on the black. Let me know because I'm pouring my chant for four gels and I really like it but I can do a super okay so matte top coat and I am going to Bella I have a quick question right here Bella that's a uh, Attention for new clients, you need to claim it to the beginning of the end and ask because usually you want. Uh, Bella, this is the questions regarding to the, um, the payments and stuff like that. You can um, via us on email at info at blitzaccessoryandsuch.com. Can you do us a favor with that so then someone's office will able to respond you with that questions? Oh, Keisha, nice. You have three bottles of precision glue. It's gonna last you for a long time. Okay, what are you are you talking? Are you asking about payments um, for the client at the salon, or you're asking about payments for asking about the products? Mm -hmm. I, oh, the clients, the Bella. So for the clients, I can help you answer that questions because I didn't know that you're asking for the products. So for the, you have a questions for the new clients. Do you take payments at the beginnings or the end? I ask because usually I went into middle. Or and but the new clients who knew they couldn't pay wait to say okay great question so I, I'm sorry earlier I get a little bit confused I thought that was uh, payments for the products uh, if you take a client usually I consult with the clients first and then you have to make sure you consult with the clients and for instance if the set of the nails it costs them $70 or $80 or whatever it depends on what they like to do but if um, you just tell them, okay, you sit down and do the new set ABC. And if the communication is was important, we uh, get an opportunity to talk about that. And we'll pass uh, a few video ago. So I'm gonna put. Give me one second. I'm gonna put this one first. Quick. Uh, I'm gonna do a matte top coat quick, and then let it cure, and then we can talk about that. Great. Quick. And. Uh, so I would take a deposit if you if you make appointments with the client. You want to have set, set up system. There's a lot of different apps that you can using to set up the system to have the client's deposit on it. Because if the clients are serious and want to services, they should able to make appointment and deposit for you, especially with the new clients. You don't want to do entire set and a beautiful set and so much work for you. And then clients come, oh, I didn't expect to pay like $70, $80 or $100 for this. I didn't know it's that much. It happened a lot for so many years. I got being an opportunity to be in this beauty business. So you just need to consult with the clients and communicate with them. So you can tell them that this set is going to be, if you're doing whole set with two blings out nails, it's going to be cost you $100. That's including a shape, including your length, and including the designs for you. So you can have know that if the clients are, oh, I don't know if I want it, or like, oh, let me think. So then that's why the clients get an idea of what they're expecting and what they get into. But if the clients are, oh, no problems, I'm cool with that, doesn't matter. But if they are like not sure, they will tell you right away. Uh, 60 seconds. 
Thank you, Boris. Please. Hope I hope is I can I didn't help answer that questions. Oh, true, Janae. I'm so glad you received the trifecta today. I'm so glad, and I can't wait to see your beautiful creation. Yep, the claws by Kinsey is a great question, a uh, great answer. Thanks so much for sharing it too. And then claws by Kinsey said, I take the deposit that go toward the first service and I get the rest payment after. That's absolutely, that's what we're doing. Because even though we're doing it with the lashes and everything too, we do consult and then we take the deposit and then the deposit will go toward to, toward to their payment. Live as you have three condensed glue gels. Thank you so much, Kinsey. Okay. Great. Okay, Bella. So hope I hope I answered the question. I was like a little bit. Uh she's like and I would didn't pay. Yeah, if you know it's unfortunately you can't take her again because that is your hard work and your heart and your dedication put in there. Okay, so is Bella there? Okay. Okay, great. So I hope I answer the questions. I hope I have. Yes. So I'm sorry. It was only I was getting confused. Yep. And then you consult with the clients. Um, Bella, consulting and then communication is the keys because you can have, you can really like can tell the clients and read in their eyes that they are willing to pay for the price that you ask for or they're not. They can tell you right away. So. You don't waste your time and uh, your hard work and your products and your time is important because everything else you can do it. Money you can make more, you can't make time back. Just one thing is important. So, okay, this one is great. And then I'm going to using is super cute is this going to be precision brush for gel painting, but this is in white color. I need to talk to clients the same one for a long time it was my first one in a while okay gotcha we always always like in our uh, salon that I work so always talking to clients will consult the clients even on the phone and when the clients even are walking to get trying to get appointments we always and we respect them by consult with them to be honest you know so that's why we're in the same page and all the clients are even like asking through social media, so then that way we can able to serve them better. So I'm gonna using just give a really like a dot right in the centers and then draw the C. You know, new clients is good if you have the space for new clients. Like it's always good. Um, I think that's like it's Bessie Vicky. She had the clients for like what 28 years, long time. But sometimes you know the clients moving in the place I work in the salon. Um, at um, the clients in military, like every three years they move, so then we have to build the new ones, you know. So it's great to take a new client. It's just like so you don't feel you feel like you're afraid of to talk to clients, or you're afraid of like if you tell them a price, they are not gonna do it. Just be honest with them and consult. I think you'll do really great. You did good though. All right, so same techniques with the uh, earlier. This one you can see it better. I think it's a white one. You don't need a whole lot of this. This pre-seasoned brush is really uh, awesome. It's really precise. Live brass. Are you speaking in like Spanish? Teach me Spanish. I would love to learn. Or I don't know. I want to learn it. 
I, my um, really close friend, good friends who's in a different state, she's like a, my god mom and she speak, she speaks Spanish so well. Well, actually she was always born, well, she knows she was born in San Diego, but she is amazing. She took good care of me cook for me, really good food. <laughs> Thank you so much, Live Ross. Like I said, I wish I can do that again, so I understand so I can like help, but thanks so much for the love and support, Live Ross. <laughs> You're amazing. Great. So I usually get in a little bit bigger on the petals so I can make it look so natural. It's really cool and easy with this one. Um, thank you, Livas. You're amazing. Hi Laura, thanks so much for tuning in. So I'm going to do it like gradually and get this uh, flowers smaller. The glam blur, thank you so much. I know the black and white is showing really details. I think she has what she opened in. Uh, Laura, at the moment we have two gel, uh, two colors is in coming a black and white there are more colors coming in the futures please stay tuned but the two main colors is the black and white we got the most uh, popular and everybody asking for it but there's gonna be more colors coming there are totally 12 of them just like sneak peek for you to know um all right so i'm gonna using this and i can't wait to like Get to share all 12 colors, different colors, and it's going to be so much fun to doing with the different color as well.
this precision brush is really is it's cool this make it so much easier for me and basically you can just like You want to great I think I'm good I'm gonna using my sugaring uh, I have the white sugaring right here and I accidentally I have a white AB from the jar though I'm good okay just make sure you pull it in like you can do it in like four time and make sure tap it down and sugaring it again Just a trace of uh, spinning on it. I will do like probably about four times at least to make sure is the all the sugars powders like this glitters powders will absorbing it to my gel painting. So I am gonna cure it for sixty seconds. Spoon cure. Thank you, Laura. Hope you're enjoying it. Is we did. Um, let me dust this off quick because okay. I get this one is a little bit sugaring right here. So I just a mess right here. But we did really cool today. It's really simple, easy, quick using a precision brush. And um, okay, you can see it. this one is hard to see, but it's closer. No, I know it actually is, looks good though. The black one is really stunning. I mean, seeing pictures is really different. And then we're using a precision brush to uh, the gel painting, using it to draw a really cute roses, lace, and butterflies. Like only one crystal nails today, everyone. I give all of you ladies, my lovely ladies, a break. Oh no, I should just want to have crystals on it. I'm taking it back. Simple one today. So, like, I'm gonna dust this one off. This is for all of you who is like really online to do some simple gel painting. Like, even it's great for like uh, beginners. The clients just like sometimes I have a client just don't want any uh, crystals. Just want some painting like this. This is like you can fulfill so many different customers. So simple, right? And you can do that but if you want to add crystal on you more than welcome you absolutely can and this is the first second third one somehow this one is weird let me top coat that one thank you laura i know like i love the crystal i want to so you can see like a variety of different thing that you can offer with the clients. I love crystal too. I'm gonna wipe the other ones off. April, so far so good. I'm going to start up again probably tomorrow. Not this weekend. Been really busy work and need a little break. Keja, don't be mad because you can always we saved that video earlier. So when after the live video um finish, you can go in and um 
you can be uh, go back into the story time and watch the live videos so it's there for you so don't worry if you are missing it's just really simple and I'm just using basically that and then the um, sugaring if you're seeing a stretch on the um, section is sugaring I'm sorry I'll pull it from the jar so it's like a little bit messy on this tray but super beautiful you have to see it yourself to expand it um, and it's in the sugaring section though when we get to do a show, we get to do a lot of de demonstrations and so many people love this. You can do like um, is the layer on the top like this or you can do it like um, showing completely the nails. This looks great. So this is uh, four nails today. Everyone's we did it like uh, we did a theme black and white today. Really cool. Hope you're really enjoying it. just a little bit I don't know which one is your number I like them all we did the gentle voice and crystal placements what one of my favorites is centerpiece I love it if you are at the clients let's get one of this in yours um, collection this is one of really is really statements on the nails I have to say and we did the um, pre-season brush gel painting in the black right there on the top of the white nails and I did the matte top coat first and cure for 60 seconds and I'm using um, gel paintings in black bottles and pre-season brush and I'm drawing outline for the butterflies and then this one we did that money back asking the questions for the jolly uh, black nails that we did it like maybe a couple weeks ago with the lace and chanfer foil so we did it again today and we did one drop of the gel painting a black I'm sorry a regular gel polish you have in the salons one drop and then three drop of your base gels or top gels either way but if you need to do it like some design which is uh, 40 gels on which is the last video we did is uh, with 40 gels so then I would use a base gel to mix with um, the black gel polish so then you have a little tacky layer so then you can lay your 40 gels on um, and we did the same with precision brush on the gel painting on this after we we draw the lines and look like a lace and then we draw the roses on it and play some crystal with our trifecta and uh, this nails we using a uh, black shell polish and a uh, matte top coat and we draw we use uh, we did use this a uh, gel painting and precision brush in white colors See how it's really precise, the brush. Never have to worry about anything. And long enough so you can do it like a long stripe without have to worry. Usually we're doing with tinted brush, tinted brush with a shorter stripe, but this is with a long stripe. So I'm so excited that you can see me doing it like literally. It's just so freaking simple. And then after that, after you're happy with the designs you want, and I did the white uh, sugaring. And pour all over four times and keep for 60 seconds and then here you go you got the nails so excited and we are so excited that you all have it thank you so much Camden thank you cake and sweet I'm so mad so okay y'all don't mad so I have I will save it then we have it in the story time so you can look it up look the first and second can't wait to catch to replace yes thank you and the first and second is fun and stunning um, thank you so much it's just so simple uh, the glam girl if you be watching them you see how simple it is I just like draw outline and then we did it so you know play with this I think you can get it down really simple and easy thanks so much live rats for the love and support Thank you so much, Lucy. Oh, I have we're talking about food now, sweet tooth. Sarisa, I am too. I love sweet stuff. I can't help it. I always want sugar too. Mummy bag was going to ask for the keys. Oh, brownies? 
Live as my kids love brownies. The nails girls. Okay, good night. Well, hold on. 5 a.m. I'm sorry. Where are you? Are you in Australia or are you in Europe or where are you? You're 5 o'clock in the morning. Thanks so much, Lunel, the glam girl. Thank you, Debbie. Thank you, April. Five goodness. Kenzie, thank you so much. Thank you, Sonia. I appreciate it. You're going to love this. It's so uh, really easy, simple. Oh, okay. Nigeria, so that is like five o'clock in the morning. I got you. Good night, guy from California. Thanks so much, Bonnie. Bonita, thanks so much. Thank you, Dialix. Thank you so much, lady. And I really enjoy it. Today's all the products you can find on our website, glitzaccessoryandsuch.com. If you are on Instagram, uh, if you are on uh, Amazon, just shopping for your family or whatever you're doing it with your art and stuff and you can always find this one as well condensed gel is up there for you for your convenience and precision glue up there on amazon primes and you get it for free shipping also if anything else or including that condensed glue gel you can always find it at our official website glitzaccessoryandsuch.com and on our um distributors local distributor in pensacola is a nailcompany.com and uh, all the stickers and uh, Diamond Dust Pixie will be 20% off. Uh, so if you see some of your stickers, your favorite ones, you know, it's such a great price off. So then that way you can get variety of them to doing it for your clients or for your press on nails. And um, you please looking forward for the posts later today for a giveaway, a 40,000 giveaway. We'll pass over that, you know, which is great, which is that amazing, which is amazing, overwhelming with a lot of love and support from every single of you. I want to really like, you know, take a moment to say thank you so much from the love and support um, for throughout all years long for past over two years and we are continue to trying really hard and our best always be on your side and supporting you as well as you're supporting us you know like you all put us so much give us so much love and support so it's time for us and then to get back to our community and always supporting all of you and uh he's gone already like that he's <laughs> like that Yes, you can. You can. Everybody have equal to enter life us. So yeah. So later today it's gonna be a post of forty thousand giveaway, and and then we are heading to like is going to a big milestone fifty thousand coming up. Which that's gonna be amazing. I can't wait. And without like every single of you wouldn't be here. So every single time when I finish with life videos. I do it from my heart when I'm enjoying it, get myself into it. But by the end, I'm really, really like feel a truly like grateful. Every single of you, you know, take your time and learning something. Even like we, even like one or two techniques you're learning something is great. I'm really, really uh, glad that you enjoying it and learn something every day. But please, if you have any questions, please feel free to DM us. DM is get a lot of um, uh, inquiries. So if you want a fast response, emails is the best way and the fastest way is always in the office that people is going to respond it to you at info at glitzaccessoryandsuch.com regarding to the order or is um, regarding to the products, anything will take good care of you. Or you can call us at 206-771-5086 or text us at your convenience uh, regarding to your order, um, anything, products, techniques, anything. We'll get back to you and um, with email as well. So or if you need assistance to help order the product, anything, call us or text us at 206-771-5086. We'll be really glad to and happy to assist you. Um, if you need it and Debbie yes is on 
we're probably gonna comment all on that big post for the enter to win so make sure you enter to win and when you enter to win make sure you follow every single step don't miss anything because then uh, then that way it will able to call you in um, oh it's coming um, that Alex you're gonna see in the post later and then you'll see how you can enter. It's really simple and easy, and you're not gonna missing it. Just follow all the steps. Live ads, yes. Is um, when you finish with the video, please share with us. We'd love to see your prize, and I can we can get chance to see your prize, and you're happy with this, and uh, what you gonna like have so many cool things because I know you're so talented, you're so good, you can play so many with that, and the team is get the shipments out to you. So I'm so. Glad you got it. And she got live ass one last time for it was thirty thousand followers giveaway, right? Live ass, and uh, she received over a thousand dollars worth of Gliss products. So she has so many of them. She is gonna be the one who's sharing with because she's the one receiving it. I was like, I can't wait to see it. So she got like over a thousand dollars of worth of products, and then um. Then this coming is gonna be forty thousand giveaway. So we can't wait. And thank you so much. And then also with the great big sales, they are working on it. So everything um, is getting everything. And thank you every single of you for contribute and uh, you know support throughout all this time and help for the you know WHO World Health Organization. So then that way we can make every single of you a full feel and it contributes in it to help it out to fight with coronavirus. So thank you, thank you. A millions you know so let's see nails by Laurie Laurie's you can able to enter there's like everybody have equal to enter is next coming next time and uh, uh, so please enter so and tag your friends and so then they can, their friends can enter to win to get chance to win too so everyone <laughs> So, like I said, I have the video, but it's too long. I had to edit it, and my kids were watching Toy Story in the background. Um, so I want to put music over it. Laugh out loud. You can, if you, I think the video is 15 minutes. You can upload it to, um, uh, I think it's Instagram. It will like less than 15 minutes. You can't, and then you can just mute it. You can, if you don't want, what, oh, you want to talk. That's why you want to do it. Right, so I see. Look at the, the kids, let them be. Yes, so just post it for us. Like, Debbie couldn't wait. Debbie want to see it. Is. Yes, may I enter? Everybody get time to enter. So do not hesitate to not enter because you don't, then you lose chance to win and then tag your friends and your friends can enter to win though. Yeah, I love Toy Story too. I, me for my personal I'm watching Toy Story with my kids I'm really freaking love it like I think I seeing all the characters I never get chance to watch until just recently the newest one come out so I got to watch with the kids it's really cute though it's really fun now it makes me curious and I want to, to watch the rest of them because is that is that true that every 10 years they came out with a Toy Story so life has pose it or I win <laughs> Yeah, like best to us post it and so then we can all see your beautiful like all the stuff you can play with. Thank you so much lady. I'm really enjoying it and like every single night with you. You know, every single night is a special cool thing that we're doing. Um thank you so much Tammy from Facebook. Uh I'm so glad you're enjoying it. And uh Suntella, if the post uh, gonna be on Facebook as well so on Facebook and Instagram we'll have the post so stay tuned for the later post today you will see that and then we can able to uh, post it so then you can able to enter to win I'm so excited because I can't wait so we said remember to enter to win to cake and sweet enter to win to Tammy if you're still watching make sure you enter and then Laura if you are watching on Facebook right now please enter as well um, and uh, big and then every time that I do live, I always remind every single of you like to enter to win so I'm not gonna forget it so then you all ha ladies have um, the chance to win and Genesee Gen Gen Genesee Genesee, hello, how are you?
so please looking forward for the polls so then that way you can able to enter to win thank you ladies I love you all and please stay safe have a great night I am going to see you definitely gonna see you tomorrow um I believe I think I think I am going to do live video tomorrow a little bit earlier because I have a sessions um a boot camp trainings online at seven o'clock at our central times I think so I'm gonna do live a little bit earlier tomorrow so please stay tuned if you are uh, free please tune in uh, I don't think I'm doing it later but I didn't want to announce it like for a few days earlier so then tomorrow I'm gonna be tuning in a little bit earlier so then that way I can be finished and still enjoy with you ladies time and I have my boot camp trainings online probably a few hours so then it might be too late until I'm finished so that's why I'm gonna be here earlier but I'm looking forward to see you tomorrow again I was definitely gonna see you and please look forward for that post. Maya personal where did which one did you send me, Maya, for the uh, message? Did you send it to uh the glitz accessory and such so I can check I can have the team check it? Because Maya will keep telling me but I didn't like see if because there were several of us doing that so social media so then they can check on it. Uh, but if you send it to Beauty Forever, then I, that's when I check that. April. Okay, if you're not here, send you DM. Okay, we'll, we'll do that. <laughs> Thank you so much. And if you have any... <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, okay, may I? It's all Beauty Forever. Definitely, I will definitely I will check it today. Thanks so much for letting me know. Okay, great. Perfect. So I would definitely see you tomorrow, ladies, earlier than I used to be because I think is I have a boot camp for four, like, um, four weeks in a row, which is on Wednesday and then at 7 o'clock and uh, I think it's Central Standard Time, so which is, 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 is the time that we're doing live, so I'm going to do it earlier, so then make sure we get a good time. So I would definitely see you tomorrow. Thank you so much, lady. Have a good night. Bye-bye.